My customer is concerned that the fasteners in my bracket doesn't end up like this. Instead of creating a physical prototype and testing it, I can do the same in a virtual environment. SOLIDWORKS Simulation is an easy to use FPA tool which can help you predict a product's real world physical behavior by virtually testing the CAD models. It also contains powerful capabilities known as connectors by which I can validate my fasteners and make my products even better. I have a bracket over here which needs to be validated. This bracket will be bolted on a wall with load acting on the other side. Let's start by choosing static as a type of analysis. Next, I will define the material, loads and fixture for this part. I will create a virtual wall for mounting this bracket by selecting this plane. For creating the bolts, I would select the bolt connector. Bolt connector creates virtual bolts where I can define multiple properties such as bolt dimensions, material, strength data and preloads. It solves the given conditions and provides me with the results. I will start by assessing different plots such as displacement, factor of safety or stress. I can observe that the region around the bolts have some high stress areas and I want to make sure that the bolts don't fail because of that. I will quickly go to the pin bolt check plot which shows me how many bolts are ok or not. Also the factor of safety against the desired value is shown over here. Looking at these values, I need to make some design changes for increasing the factor of safety of the bolts. I have changed the material for bolts from stainless steel to alloy steel from the bolt connector settings. And these are the results obtained from. I can now see that all my bolts are above the required factor of safety and hence OK. That's how I can run multiple iterations and choose the best one from them. There are different types of connectors such as bolt, pin, spring, weld, bearing and rigid. Let's quickly have a look at some of them. Pin connector lets you choose multiple faces and insert a virtual pin through them. You can define the material, strength data and stiffness for these pins. Similarly for creating a virtual spring, I can choose the type of spring and also define the stiffness. Using connector force results, I can check the resultant forces for the connectors. From the drop down menu, I can define which type of connector am I interested in. Now having a strong weld is very important for fabrication. I can choose whether it's an edge weld or a spot weld. I can then choose the weld type from the drop down options. I can also define the weld sizing if it is according to American or European standard. The weld check plot gives me a clear indication about whether the weld will fail or not. That's how easily I can simulate and choose the best fastener and the weld size for my components. Companies like Pronel Asia Manufacturing and Resumin uses SOLIDWORKS Simulation to create high quality products. With SOLIDWORKS Simulation, I can be rest assured about the quality of my product and can even convince my customer about the same. Furthermore, you can also use SOLIDWORKS Composer to create interactive installation manuals. For more detail about SOLIDWORKS Simulation, please click on the link given in the description below.